Agora TV. The world is thinking. When we look at price uh, back to the state level, there's a very strong relationship between temperature in August, which is the month when most of the uh, Pinot Noir in California is ripening just before harvest. So maximum daytime temperatures in that month and price. There's, there's quite a strong correlation. And for these cooler regions like Monterey, Santa Cruz, Mendocino, um, potentially a little warming might not be bad and it in fact might be good for them. It seems to be a relationship where around here looks optimal. So somewhere around 28 degrees um, is the optimal for price. But Napa and Sonoma, unfortunately, are on this side of the curve where further warming appears stressful or appears likely to reduce their price. Um, and these warm inland central valley areas, Davis, Merced, Lodi, et cetera, are at the very low end of the curve where they're, they're quite warm and they're receiving low prices for their fruit. So this is a, another reason to be concerned about warming um, in California because much of where the fruit is planted and where it's getting high values now, warming can, can, can drive those prices down and make the industry less sustainable and make it more difficult for them.